hello I'm me fixing everything and because there is always something to be fixed today I will need to change this uh, top part of a uh, of this Macpherson strut that's uh, from Volkswagen Passat 2007 B6 but January is the same for all, all of the all of the cars that have this this set. So what you're gonna do, what you're gonna need to uh, take the spring off the video, the main point of the video is how to take the spring to change whatever you need to change. What you need, and that's very basic set, is this spring compressors. You can find them handmade with a lot finer thread with a lot stronger um, hook these are the most deadly tool one of the most deadly tools that you can get yourself to um, if one of them snaps or something happens it might kill you because when you take when you take the the nut off and if this thing collapses, it will fly off. I've seen shops doing recalls on these, so this is deadly, be very careful. Um, I know of a shop owner that grabs this hook and puts the chain to the wall so the uh, spring doesn't, doesn't fly off. So be, be very careful, extreme caution when you do that. First is uh, stretch them as much, as much as you can, after you need to take the nut off. The best thing to take the nut off is to use an impact gun while you're still on the car, but be careful. This, this part here should not be undone, if you undo the nut. It, it will be deadly, it will fly off, so you need to be very careful. What I'm gonna do now, I'll check if that's the same size. No, it's not. I'll just uh, grab the correct socket and I will hit it with the impact. Okay, so size 21 on this one. Sometimes these are very hard to be undone. So just hit it once with the with the impact. Be very careful. Can you see right on the edge? Don't go any further. Just don't. <laughs> we'll do it in a second. So you need to choose a spot on the spring where to compress it. Let's see. I think that's a, I think that's a good position. Right here. Also, I have a wall right there, not, a, not the best place, so let's, uh, let's do some repositioning. This way there, it's open space, so if something bad happens and this thing flies off, it will fly off away from anything that can, that can go bad. Okay, we'll, we'll grab it here as well. Okay. 
Okay, so now, <clears throat> if you don't have an impact gun, just grab a ratchet or even a spanner and start collapsing the spring. That's the main thing. You need to be very gentle, very gentle. Did you saw that? We just missed the spot. So now, to be able to get the get the thingy here i'll need to compress it on this side be very careful you need you want to make sure that the spring compressors are on both sides evenly you don't want because it might slip on one side that's not good okay let's see let's see now what are you gonna do now? I need to yes okay so I'll take it I'll take it away from here Not the right space, but the right place for it. So be careful. Okay, I like this spot. Leave the circuit on, on the spring compressor. So remember where the dots are for when you're putting everything back together. tension on the spring. Still a lot of tension on the spring. Oh, there is no tension now. At least on one side. Let's let's see what is on the other. Okay now is the moment when you need to be very careful. I would even suggest you to don't put your fingers in there, but should be okay. Can you see? At the moment, the spring is compressed and we can take off the nut. So what we're gonna do now is take the big, take the big socket and you either need uh, the correct, there we go. So. 
21 millimeters and at this case allen key so i'm going to get an allen key thing is a seven millimeter allen key but i don't have one so we use a torx there we go and also i don't have a 21 millimeter wrench so use more grips rub it here and be absolutely sure that you have no tension you need to be confident like 100 percent okay start undoing the nuts Now, we're going to take it out, very careful. Okay. And put it somewhere safe, just put it away. Hold it like a bomb. Because it, it is, it is bad. Okay. Now, the part that I need to change is this top thing. You can see the place where you need to screw the bolts is missing. Sorry for that. bearing I'll take I'll take screwdriver because I only need to that's a bearing I only need to change the top mount okay And now this one have a direction, okay? As directional. I think that was the right direction, but I'm not completely sure. So we'll see. Well, it's always a good procedure to grab that and put some lubrication where the bearing is. You will see it now. That's the bearing. There we go. That's a that's a bearing right here. So, I'll stop the video for a second and I'll just spray some ceramic grease. I filled up the bearing on the inside with ceramic grease. Okay, it looks good. Let's check the shock absorber. It works okay stiff when you're pulling and when you're pushing that's what you want to see no play okay pull it all the way out you can spray some you can spray some uh, lubrication in here or you can leave it dry um also fine to spray just something it will make the spring go easier when you when you assemble it. Okay, good. Got some silicone spray. Let's put let's put this thing back in. Okay. Uh -huh. Now we need this part. It uh, it was like that. 
let's assemble it all together. Okay, this thing it doesn't really matter. Да, бабо и че на видео сме да знаеш. Да бе, на видео сме, на видео, си правя видео да покажа. Okay, so let's put let's put everything back together. Just push it in gently. Or not so gently. This will cover the shock absorber from any dust going in. Now we use the correct part, that's why I put a bolt. When you're changing something, make sure you're not putting the wrong part on that you need, want to change back together because it will go bad. Take the bomb now. Take the bomb, put it back in. I'm low on battery, so I just hope the phone doesn't die while I'm showing every all that. Okay, now put the the nut back in. As much as you want, as much as you can. Just tight it as much as you can. Gently and do the nuts. Start with this one because I think it was harder to get into. And then with this one. No, not this one. Yeah, I think it's this one. Yes. Okay. Both directions need to be undone together. Don't don't just undo one of them and forget to undo the other one. Now I can see this part here is binding a little bit. So I'll need to tighten it all back.
you saw how it went right there. Let's send it from the other side. Take it out. There we go. There we go, it's all in now. We need to put this thing back in as well. If it wants to, it doesn't want to really. Okay, so that's how you can change anything with two screen compressors and a ratchet automatic or air one and keep everything safe yeah if you want you can hook it up to a wall or something just handle it like a bomb because it might take your head off and it's a uh, dangerous stuff be careful i hope this video was uh, helpful to you